All right, so I got back. Oops, oh God, that could have been bad. I got back here, and I really hope you understand. Like, I'm not just being try like being mad to be mad. Like, I legitimately want this game to be like to be great. I really do because it has all the things necessary to be great. But it's just got all so many of these minor issues that all just like stack up until you know it's like they say it's the final straw that breaks the camel's back there's just so there's just the proper amount of those straws all lined up to piss me off just enough to set me off and like so i guess i just have to play this i just have to do that like i guess i don't wanna but shit so you can try to heal. It's probably usually when they back off like that, they're trying to heal, huh? But yeah, I mean for like an en for number one, for an enemy to just like parry and then one shot you. What the fuck? This better be a breakable goddamn wall. There's nothing there, really? The fuck did you have me walk through here for then? What a bunch of shit. All right, but anyway, but I mean, like, just, I mean, again, you say, you know, your game is challenging, your game is difficult, you know, you want to, you want to get it out there that you have a very difficult game, and you know what, yes, it is a very difficult game overall, but the problem is, you know, a lot of that has to do with just not knowing what's coming next. That's why I'm playing it offline, so that, you know, like, I don't see all these you know, messages that say, X is coming up. I don't want to know that. I want to learn. I want to explore on my own terms. But once you know where something is, that difficulty is, in general, gone. And so, I mean, you saw, like, the last video, how quickly I ran through this fortress that I've had, what, like, two or three videos before it of me having trouble getting through, and then I just blazed through it in, like, five minutes? And making me do that every single time I die, especially when I've gotten up here, like, it would have been the perfect place to put a bonfire right when I got up here. But instead, I have to go all the way through this entire place, and now I will bet you money that I get bullshitted out here by that fucking archer, wherever the hell he is. I think he's right up there. Yeah, he's right there. I guarantee you, I will get, unless I can magically hit him with that, not even moderately close. Move closer. Move closer, asshole. Man. I'm like, oh my god, are you serious? And I gotta deal with that shit too? Well, I better be fucking fast then. Oh, balls. Well. Oh, you gotta be fucking out your goddamn mind. You must be out of your goddamn mind. Where do I go from here? I can't drop down onto that. That's not fucking possible. There's no fucking way they expect you to drop down onto that. That's not fucking possible. <sighs> oh, well, here comes the fucking rage again. Dude, this is nonsense. This is fucking nonsense. I can't hit that. There's no fucking way I'm gonna hit that, so I gotta try and drop down all the fucking way onto this thing. Better make sure I'm fully fucking healed. I missed it. What an exciting fucking game! You slip up for half of a second, and now you gotta waste ten more minutes of fucking gameplay to get all the way back. Bull fucking shit! This is so dumb! I have had so little fun in this game since fucking getting through since fucking getting to blight town the fucking <laughs> the amount of fun i've had in comparison to the amount of frustration is just staggeringly in the frustration's favor this is so fucking stupid like i legitimately hate this game right now Oh, 
gotta keep fucking. Why do I keep playing it? If I had not, if I had not started recording and started uploading videos, I guarantee you, I would have just been like, you know, this isn't even worth it. This isn't even worth playing. It's not worth my time. By now, Blight Town would have been the fucking end of it. This is just so frustrating, dude. I can't describe in words how frustrating this is to me. I mean, like, they're saying, like, oh, this is challenging. No, it's not. I have been challenged in my life. I know what challenge is. This is not challenge. There is just so much of this game that is just built upon random f dumb luck. Either you're, either you're lucky and you get through the part unscathed, or you are unlucky and you get hit at the bad time and you're, you know, you start over again. And that is what makes this so annoying to do. Not the fact that I'm dying, not the fact... I mean, well, yes, obviously, the, quite a bit of the annoyance comes from the constant having to run through what I've already gone through multiple times. That obviously is a factor of my annoyance, but so much of the annoyance is just due to the fact that I am not dying because I fucked up. Because... You know, like, I'm not dying because I fucked up. I'm not dying because an enemy just outsmarted me and did something unexpected. I am dying out of random, dumb, bad luck. Plain and simple. And that is why I am so pissed. Because it's kind of the same thing as, like, I think the first time that I was legitimately pissed at this game was during the Capra Demon fight. And that was because so much of that boss fight comes down to, I'm gonna get hit by that, comes down to, were you lucky enough to kill the dogs before something got behind you and mauled you and then you just die? That's what a lot of that boss fight came down to. Once the dogs are dead, the Capra Demon is a cakewalk. Easy as hell to finish off. It's just, I mean, you know, you want your game to be challenging, fine. But if you want to put in so many just random factors in your game... I mean, it doesn't, it's, not, it's not challenging then. It's not, because you're not... Challenging implies that it requires, you know, it requires skill or intelligence to get through a certain spot. And sure, there are, there are parts here where, you know, you need preparation, like right here. Just having... Oh, my bad. That was my fault. You know, just having this spell. And not being able to throw it through a... F <laughs> Your character's too stupid to avoid the fucking wall. <laughs> you know, like, just being prepared there made that... Made this whole entire thing 20 times easier. Now I don't have to worry about that motherfucker, because I... You know, brought some range. I probably should have gotten hit by that, but I didn't. Lucky me. So yeah, I mean, that shit does factor in every once in a while, but there's so many times where it's... It comes down to luck. You know, did your... Oh, my bad. You know, did you randomly just have... The luck that, you know, the dude aimed at the wrong spot this time? Or did he aim at the right spot and are you now dead? It comes down to that a lot. It's very frustrating. I mean, obviously, I never played Demon Souls. So I have no, I'm not even gonna bother with that dude. There's nothing down there. Why would I bother going down there? So, I mean, like, I never played Demon Souls, so I don't know if it was different in that game. I don't know if that's where everybody said, you know, like, all deaths are fair. Maybe all deaths were fair in that game. But there are certainly a substantial amount of deaths. Where the fuck are my... You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, I'm gonna go down there and get my souls. That's fucking stupid, too. God damn it, man. Alright, so just wait for him to toss it. I need a time. Oh, is he going to toss it? Doesn't even look like he's going to. Because it kind of looks like he's looking around. For, oh, there it is. So I need to time how long that shit lasts. So 
So about, I counted to about five. So, just fucking hoping. Wow. See, that was just random luck. That certainly looked like it should have fucking hit me. Fuck yeah, you can fuck right off. Hope you never fucking come back. Hope you stay gone. You, yeah, go fall off. Go fall off like I did, you dumb piece of shit. Please tell me I can go up, and I can go kill this asshole before I go through there. Oh, hi, what's up? Oh, good! Hit me straight through a wall! Great! I love you. Oh good, I missed every single one of those attacks. All but one of them. Oh shit. See, random dumb luck. I have no idea if I can defend these attacks. Hey, look at that, I actually fucking hit him that time. I don't know if there's like... Can I break these? Oh, good, I can. Makes perfect sense that that easy to break. I'm hoping there's an item. Nothing, really? What an asshole. Hope they don't come back. Well, they shouldn't, because I can't. Well, no, that giant was on the other side, so I don't actually know. <sighs> Alright. So I came in through here, right? Yes, I came in through here. So let's look out here first. I want to make sure I don't go through the fucking fog before I check everything else out. Really? Nothing. You just send me out to a random room with nothing. Darn. Alright. Well. <laughs> Let the fun fucking begin. There's no way. There's obviously. No goddamn way this is gonna end badly. Going into a boss fight. Got any kind of a bonfire up here. How great. Oh my god, what the fuck is it doing? Is it throwing that shit at me? I think it just threw that shit at me. I dislike this. Damn. Damn! Right in his booty. Alright, I like you, Pyro. Holy shit, dude, this dude's almost dead. This dude is dead. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, Pyro! I'm glad I fucking learned you! Oh god, what did I just do? Oh fuck, what did I just do? Oh no, what did I just do? Oh, what did I just do? Man. Should've looked around first. I didn't even, like, I just saw it and I thought it was an item drop. I thought it was an item drop, so I tried to grab it, and then I saw a ring of light, but it was too fucking late. God damn it. Holy shit, that's impressive. But god fucking damn it. I thought it was an item drop. I was not prepared for this! At least they didn't kill me, I guess. Some bitch. Where the fuck am I now? Oh, I'm in. And Orlando, good to know.
the fuck am I talking to? Oh, hi, bro. What's up? Oh, God. Are you- No! What the fuck? <laughs> are they taking me back? I hope they are, because I want to explore. I'm sure I missed- I'm sure there was something around there. Oh, I thought they were going to drop me off on that ledge. I was about to be so sad. <laughs> Here, let me drop you off on this random ledge. Have fun. Okay, good. So they're dropping me right back where I was. And that was as far away as it was. Didn't that- That certainly looked like it was a hell of a lot further away than that ended up being. So let's see. So do not, do not touch the ring of light. Go in here first. Oh, there's really nothing? Really? Oh. Well then. Fair enough, I guess. Alright, well. Back we go. Is it the same exact scene? Yep, we don't have to watch this then. Alright, so let's not talk to that dude. Actually, let's just start a new video for Anor Londo.